Did you know an engineer deliberately crashed a prototype into a concrete wall to save lives? In 1989, the Dodge Viper was just a flashy concept car, never meant for real roads. Then Chrysler made a shocking decision, make it street legal. But there was one massive problem. The Viper had zero safety equipment. Lead engineer Roy Schoberg faced an impossible deadline for crash testing. With no time for computer simulations, he made a terrifying choice. He would drive the prototype himself straight into a barrier at 35 miles per hour. On test day, Schoberg climbed behind the wheel of the only existing prototype. He aimed directly at the concrete wall and floored it. The impact was devastating. The entire structure crumpled like paper. Schoberg walked away, but barely. The car was completely destroyed. That crash revealed the Viper's deadly secret. It would have killed anyone in a real accident. His sacrifice forced a complete redesign, delaying production for two years, but it created the safety foundation for America's most dangerous sports car, 